Hey guys, welcome to another vlog. This is my third English speaking vlog ever. As you guys can see, my hair is kind of like a mess, so I need to get a haircut. So hopefully you guys will like my vlog. Let's go. Since I haven't done my hair yet, so I've decided to wear a cap. I guess a lot of people are wondering why I speak English in my vlog. I think the main reason is that I always encourage my students to step outside of their comfort zones and seek discomfort because I firmly believe that's when people make progress. Otherwise, you are stagnant. You stay at the same place forever and ever. Obviously, English is not my first language, so when I speak in English, it's kind of like challenging myself and uh, stepping outside of my comfort zone as well. So I guess this is how I make progress. This is, you know, how I do it, okay? All right, let's go. I got my hair appointment at 2.30. So right now I have some time. Let's go grab a coffee first. So I just arrived at this coffee shop. It's called uh, Locking Coffee. It's right here. Oh my god. So I just pulled at the door, it didn't open. It actually says push, all right? How stupid am I? Hi. Hello. My name is Tony. I'm here to get my coffee. Can you give me my coffee, please? Yeah. What's your name? Lydia. The Lydia is able to speak some English, which is very good. I'm doing this English speaking vlog. Hopefully you don't mind. Right. Oh, in locking coffee, you have to pay. You just come here and get your coffee and then you go. That's how we do it. No, I don't know. So here's my coffee. I just got my coffee. I used to drink uh, oat milk latte, but nowadays I prefer coconut milk latte, which is really good. And especially when it's iced, like super good. And I'm really a big fan of coffee. And according to some statistics, it's really good for your body and health, you know what I mean? You know, I'm very conscious about my health. I'm not exaggerating without coffee. Literally, I cannot live. Coffee made my day. See ya, bye-bye. I'm like a foreigner here. No, can I shout? Hi. Oh, Li Hao. Long time no see. I'm so sorry to say that. I can't count my hair right now because I have my backpack with me. So I have to drop my backpack first. You guys stay together and stay safe. See you guys later. So the first step of getting a haircut is to wash your hair. It's not actually washing my hair, it's actually just getting my hair wet because I've washed my hair with shampoo at home. My hair is wet right now, so I'm ready to cut my hair. Can I get a coffee, please? Yes. Thank you. Just uh, finished uh, cutting my hair and ready to wash my hair and then put some wax on and then it's done. So for this time, I like to change the position to wash my hair. Not like the traditional way, I'll just do it like creative way. All right, let's try it. So the washing part is done. Ooh. Goodbye, man. Thank you, bro. Okay. All right, so finally I'm done with my hair. So what do you think of my hairstyle? Is it good? Uh, I actually cut my hair every two weeks. What about you guys? All right, how often do you guys cut your hair? Let me know in the comments down below. Peace out.